and I have five girls, so it's really terrifying to know that, that she can't go to school and be safe there. A mother sits one on one with First Alert 4 after she says someone sexually assaulted her daughter at school. The person she's accusing is another student, and tonight police are investigating. Only our Melanie Johnson brings us the mother's message after she says the school district dropped the ball. Melanie? Tim McCoy, Normandy High School's principal says they acted quickly to address the allegation, but the victim's family says the high school has special needs was sexually assaulted between classes yesterday. Only four hears from the mother who takes issue with how the school district is handling this case. Who failed your daughter? The high school did. Shanique Wickshaw reached out to First Alert 4 to speak on behalf of her daughter, who she says has special needs and was violated at school this week. She got to take HIV medicine for 30 days just because they failed to watch my child. Shaw says her daughter, an 11th grader, was heading to class Tuesday when a male student stopped her, claiming he needed help finding his class. This mother tells us her daughter reported the student lured her to the back of the campus and attacked her. She says she screamed there was no one there, no one in sight. North County Co-op says they are investigating a sexual assault at Norman High School, but did not reveal more. Shaw says there is no video of what happened to her daughter. I don't understand why they don't have cameras on the route that she took if that's the route that all these kids take daily to get to their classes. I didn't reach out to the superintendent today. No one returned my calls. The, the caseworkers then reached out to me. No one returned the calls. First Alert 4 obtained this statement from the high school's principal saying in part, quote, school officials received information about an alleged inappropriate incident by one of our scholars against another scholar. He goes on to say the school took immediate action and made sure families received appropriate support. Something Shaw says her daughter claims is not true. She had to reach out herself and call us. In April, former Normandy Middle School teacher Christopher Daniels was charged with multiple counts, including statutory rape, after he allegedly assaulted a 12-year-old student. Something Shaw says represents a deep issue with Normandy schools. Anything can happen to anybody's kid her, and they have no clue what's going on. I did reach out to Normandy schools today asking for more information about this alleged assault. The district referred me to their previous statement 24 hours ago. Shaw is urging other parents to call the superintendent and the school principal to inquire what is being done to keep kids safe from sexual assault in Normandy schools. Melanie Johnson, Look for. A story we'll continue to follow. All right, Melanie, thank you. Tonight is St.